Don't forget you have to brush your teeth, okay? Did you wash your hands? Yes. Throw out the, the bag. Welcome back to our coverage of this Q School event, already in progress. We're resuming action on the fifth hole. Let's get going. Really, not that we're looking for. This shot from the first cut of run. Going with the five iron here. This one's going to the right. Oh, what a lovely shot. You'll be delighted to be inside the range there. Slim chance for a birdie, but in all reality, two putt for par would be just fine. Too bad. This putt just five feet away from the hole. They're nicely hole. Our current leader is enjoying a one six ah! lead. Down the right hand side are a nuisance. Upon fronting the left part of the green, should not come into play if players find the fairway off their tee shot. Second shot to a very flat green. You can get it close, but still difficult on the long par four. I'm playing a game. What happened, Daddy? I'm playing a game. I didn't hit. I didn't do too well. Well, 
The six <laughs> particularly the approach which at TPC Boston is a very strong one. If they put the pin other than front left near the water, it's a good birdie opportunity. But once that pin sneaks over to the left hand side, watch out. Bogies and doubles come into the equation very quickly. What a shot from the rough. This is gorgeous. And he's safely on the green. There's a long way, but I tell you what, I've seen it happen before, so there's a chance. What? What, babe? That was a gallant attempt. Boss, what about boss? No, she's not boss. She's a um, coordinator. Coordinator. That's just a coordinator. You like the boss? That gives people assignments, but not necessarily a boss. Managing to maintain their position on the leaderboard. Seeing off here at the seventh. Power five, and only the long players can reach in two. Find the fairway, and then make a decision. Do I go over the large bunker 100 yards away, or do I lay back of it? Either way, you must make a par five here, because birdies will be had by the big hitters. That's not his style. Henny, do you have a better look at this line? Looks like they have a good lie here in the second cut. No harm, no foul there with that shot. Getting ready to play their field. And he's down there, and the breeze has just got up. You see where the flags are flickering, and it's straight back up into this player. Good shot there. Outside chance here for the par. Let's take a look. Setting up here with a very long putt. This one to save par. Oh, just missed it. This one's for bogey. Well hold. Let's move on. Sitting at seven over for the day. And moving down the leaderboard as well. We find ourselves on a par three here. Par three and a diabolical green to say the least. The left hand side sits much higher than the right hand side and the green is usually very firm, a tough ask.
Going with the five wood. This one's right off the green. That one seems to get away from the rich. The wind is absolutely swirling uh, around this part of the golf course. Or maybe a, star, a strong stream of it, if it's really strong. I like the music in this game. Mm -hmm. oh, a lovely opportunity to save power here. Which music? Alright. Surely it's going to. What's up, baby? Oh, wonderful effort. Confirms the power. What? And now it's for the round. You do the best you can. That's it. That's okay, What? We've reached the ninth hole. Time to tee off. Ninth hole, bunkers down the left, and will not come to play. I don't trust three it. Three okay. below the players on their second shot. We have seen birdies made here in the past, but they are really difficult to come by. And what are we looking at here, Henny? Setting up here from about 185 yards. a little wide with coming up a little short with that effort not bad though oh dear can he get out of here this reminds me of my breakfast nice fried egg i know it is but it shouldn't be you do the best you can don't overthink it it's going to be coming out of the bag but uh, a long way from the hole this putt for par here Oh, what a shame. That would have been a nice one to hold. Oh, gee, that line was looking good, wasn't it? Just three feet to the cup. <laughs> that gets the job done. And as we head over to the 10th hole, Rich, this player will enter their final nine holes of Q School. How will they be feeling? Luke, this is the spot where you either fail or shine. And I gotta say, nine holes left to put themselves in the top 50 to make it on the Corn Ferry Tour. Failing is definitely an option for this player. Yeah, that'll work, that's fine. Second shot here at the 10th. Stay with the nine iron, I think. This one might roll into the rough. Seem to lose the handle on that shot. 
Green's regulation today has been absolutely abysmal, and that is reflective on their scorecard. And here we are with their four. Playing their fifth shot. That's a wonderfully played chip shot there. Gotta say, his short game is phenomenal. And there it is. Sitting at 11 over for the day. Chance here to reclaim a bit of focus after that double up the last. Par three measures 231 yards from the back. A very difficult test indeed. A long green that is unforgiving as it slopes from back to front quite severely. Birdies are hard to run by as pars can be as well. This would be a great up and down. And here we are with the third shot. Lovely touch. Well played. Just eyeballing that one, trying to make it. It's looking solid. Yep. Well hold for bogey. A little slide happening here on the leaderboard. See if he can bounce back. And on the tee now, coming off the bogey. And have a bit of a sting in the tail, I'd imagine. Par four, 510 yards. It is a brute. Those bunkers down the right-hand side are a natural attraction for wayward golf balls. Second shot is down the slope. A big, deep, gaping bunker on the right-hand side will also find its fair share of golf balls. All in all, just a tough hole, to say the least. And that's not ideal. Finding the trees. Ah, that's a little untidy. Yeah, this lies pretty deep here. This one may come up just a tad short here. Oh, clever play that. Just get it back into the fairway. Playing their fourth shot. This one is heading to a really not so good space. Time for the fifth show. What's in front of them, Henny, with this putt? Setting up this putt 15 feet from the cup. And just a little bit of cleanup work remaining on this hole. And a little slide down the standings after that hole. Here we have a long par four. It's going to take two great shots to get on. Tee shot up the hill to a blind landing area. Second shot is to a green that is surrounded by a cavern of bunkers. If you miss all those and find the green in two, then you'll have a decent look at a birdie three. Oh my god. That's a good looking shot there. 
and what's in front of them there, Henny? Setting up here from about 145 yards. Yeah, not a bad shot, that one. And this putt is from birdie three on the scorecard. Shot so good, we need to have another look. I could watch this one all day. Who would have thought that would go in? The leader now has a one stroke advantage. We have a par four on this one. Fairway sweeps from right to left down the hill. Should you find the fairway, you'll have a decent look at finding the green in two. But I gotta say, it is a difficult par four, and you'd be happy to walk away with that score. He's hooked this one. What's up, What's Henny, how's that ball lying? It's tough to see from here. Looks like they have a bad lie here in the second cut. I don't know what this thing does. I know, baby. Nobody does. Your grades are unaffected. Your grades are unaffected, though. What you do in school affects your grade. So the tests you take at school, the assignments, your homework, your reading, Going that's what affects your grade. Has he hit it? No, it doesn't quite look like it. Time now for the fourth what? shot. Oh, fudge. Yeah, it's graded, but it's not graded. Setting up to play the shot here from the green side rough. And this next putt is for triple bogey. Right over the spot they were looking at. Yeah, you'll take that. Teeing off here at the 15th hole. Par four, and a fun little par four at that. Just 421 yards from the back. Fairly generous fairway, but a green that can provide some entertainment as there's some different swales in the green and your golf ball can go a wandering if you're not careful that's not what they hoped for i'm definite about that this lie is not great going with the eight iron here uh, this one's heading towards the rough i think uh, a little off the mark on that approach shot distance control nearly impossible coming out of this rough in front of them, Henny. This one will run uphill. Yeah. Oh. Ouch, that hurts. Putting for bogey. And down it goes. Oh. 
And now on the tee, coming off a bogey, trying to reclaim some momentum. Watch out for this green. There's a large shelf on the right-hand side. If it's up there, good luck getting it close. And whatever you do, don't be silly and hit it left in the water. That's just a bad shot. Yeah, this is lovely. Wow, what happened there? Oh, the wind wreaks havoc with another golf ball. Wow, what a save. Not a good lie. Fortunate to hit the pin and go in. Well, that's worth a replay. Let's take another look. Beautifully judged. Great tempo on this chip. leader is enjoying a one-shot lead. Let's see what happens here at the 17th. Dog leg from right to left. Second shot is down the slope. Lots of bunkers on this hole. But should you avoid them and find the sliver of a green, then birdie will be on your mind. From around 180 yards out. Wind is blowing from right to left here. Wants to work it against the wind. This one looks to be a tad wayward. He didn't look to hit that one quite so flush. Oh, look at that. The wind just wreaking havoc with that shot. Disappointing. And here we are with the third shot. And here we are with their four. Well played. All over the parking lot, but a chip in for par saves the day. And let's have another look at that one. Yeah, this was a gift. Wasn't expecting this. has a one-stroke advantage. It's time for the official return of the creepy doll prank. A lot of you guys request this video and even YouTuber Of all the finishing right holes on the PGA prank. Tour, Rich, there's plenty to feel the two PC balls should be right up with the very down best of them. Also, the are looking time. to take it down the left-hand side and get the extra chase on the golf ball down the slope. a very short second shot to a dangerous green. Big deep bunker right and a large hollow on the left hand side. Birdies and Eagles have been made before, but so have sixes and sevens.
Ay, me re asusté, boluda. Ay. No, that's not the shot they wanted. Yeah. And from the bunker here. What's the matter? From around 140 yards here. Went straight down. And he's not hit the mark on that approach. Well, story of the day for this player is just missed too many greens. You can't afford to do that. This is their fifth shot. Ooh, that almost went down. Just 10 feet to the cup here. And with that, this part has finished their Q School final, but Rich, unfortunately they didn't manage to make it to that all-important top 50.
and won't be able to advance to the Corn Ferry Tour next season. However, on their side is the opportunity to do it all again next year. The player is going to have a rough go of it for another year until they can get back and hopefully get into the Corn Ferry Tour Championships. A fair bit of soul searching, I would imagine. There's going to be a lot of searching for for your game a little bit. I mean, you're traveling, living on the road full time. It's not easy, nor fun. The dirty ones? Hopefully we'll make this player better in the future. The, the ones with stripes? Yeah. The neighbor.